Well, good morning, everybody, and welcome to Power Play 2021 here at Mailbox Power. I have with me, I'm, I'm surrounded by giants today. Like, literally, this is awesome. I have my partner, I have my partner Justin Biggs, and my partner Ken Inkley, and I love them both. Um, but I must tell you as well, as you can see, I have uh, one of uh, my partners in crime as well, Vanessa Hunter and Casey Eberhardt. And I have so many good things to say about them. It might take me a half an hour to introduce them properly, but um, in the essence of time, I just want you to know I love and trust them and they are the ones that help us grow this business. And it is an amazing thing to have a team like we do today. Look around. This is awesome. It feels wonderful. Anyway, today um, we're going to talk about a lot of things. Uh, well, we're going to talk about quite a few things. We're really going to talk about is a new product launch. And I know you all want to see it immediately, but that can't happen. Uh, <laughs> because y'all know I have my favorite topic, right? <laughs> all right. Yeah, I know. Vanessa laughs. Everybody's laughing. You probably know what I'm going to talk about, right? I'm not I'm not going to get right into the product launch. And by the way, my, my camera focus works. Everything's really good today. So you are going to get to see these new products soon enough. But of course, um, Vanessa, am I okay to talk about birthdays? Go for it. Absolutely. <laughs> yeah, okay with that for a minute? Absolutely. Okay. Um, it's official. I'm on my soapbox talking about birthdays, folks. Uh, the birthday campaign challenge that we had, we, we crushed it. We passed the line. 101,626 birthdays celebrated and still counting. As a matter of fact, that was yesterday's numbers. And I know it's already increased. And I am just so proud of everything that we've done together, how we've moved together uh, as a group and as a company. And we have added, and we are going to celebrate in the next 12 months at a minimum 101,626 birthdays. There will be, my estimation, 20,000 of those. It'll be the only birthday card they get. Can you even just imagine that? The only birthday card somebody's going to get is going to come right here from this building from you and your customers or whoever it is uh, that's going to get these. I think that's an amazing, amazing thing uh, for us to all celebrate. But anyway, um, before we get started, um, tell me, Casey, are you excited? I am. I, like, get on with it. I'm so excited <laughs> because... You guys, I know what's coming and I'm sitting here like hands in pocket. Vanessa and I are like, we're so excited. So let me just say, today truly is going to change a game. It, it, and so get on with it. Yeah. <laughs> Vanessa, um, anything before we get started here? I, here's, here's how impactful this announcement is going to be, in my opinion, Joe. I didn't sleep last night. And you know what? I know Casey didn't either because I posted something and he commented 30 seconds later and it was 2 a.m. <laughs> I just oh I'm looking forward, I'm looking forward to a nap like next week. <laughs> oh my insomniac friends, I love you. Mm. I was there too. <laughs> oh, Justin, anything? You know what? I'm tired. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> It's been a busy, busy week and a busy, week? busy quarter. Oh, my goodness. Jeez. Oh, my goodness. Oh. I mean, we'll get into some numbers, but holy cow. <laughs> Ken. I, I'm not ready to sleep. Okay. <laughs> Let's go bigger. <laughs> I love it. I love it. All right, folks. With that being said, I guess we can go ahead and get started and satisfy Casey's needs. Here we go. All right. Uh, all right, folks, we're going to start with this, the state of the mailbox. I have a couple of things I really want to share with you. Listen, it's been an amazing journey uh, for the last two years, just an absolutely phenomenal journey. We have experienced 260% growth in the last 12 months. Uh, I think you all know I spouted these numbers off last year. Our growth continues. And I just love the fact that our customers are winning. Their phone is ringing. They're, they're getting the referrals. They're creating the relationships where, you know, only transactions existed before. Uh, it really is a phenomenal feeling to help people, uh, you know, through this business journey that they're in. And it doesn't matter if they're young or old. Uh, we have a fit for everybody uh, in business. So anyway... Now this next this next statistic I got to tell you I went into Justin yesterday because he's the keeper of all knowledge around here okay <laughs> all the numbers he's got at his fingertips him and Jerry and 
he had realized that we have already had one mil, over 1 million shipments in 2021 already. And I don't think last year we just barely reached a million shipments the whole year. And that's four months, folks, just four months. And I, I got to tell you, the growth is accelerated and it's impressive. Okay. And of course, the 101,626 people enrolled in birthday campaigns, that's a bigger number already. That was yesterday's number. So anyway, and then we're also proud of the fact that we've broke ground on a new building. Uh, the pictures you're looking at were from yesterday. Like those are the footings and the plumbing pieces that are getting ready to get trenched and dug into the ground. It's for real. There's going to be a real building for us uh, by the end of this year, we hope. You know how contractors go, right? Okay. <laughs> anyway. where's, where's the wood to knock on? Oh, that's right. right. It's skyrocketing right now. <laughs> exactly. That's exactly right. Oh, my goodness. So anyway, you know, we're just excited. We're just excited to be on this journey with all of you, especially our customers. Listen, our customers, the customers that are listening to me right now, um, I love you. I'm so thankful you're here. I am so thankful we can help you in your business. And we're thankful because we're doing it together and you're helping us grow this business. We're helping you grow your business. And we stand shoulder to shoulder with you. Uh, we're ready to help you in any way we can. We're here to serve. So, all right, let's move along. So here we go. What have we done lately? Now, I can't, <laughs> I can't even answer this question. Um, I'm just going to point, Justin, um, Will you share with everybody what you've done lately? Sure. Okay, go ahead. Sure. <laughs> so, I mean, apart from the massive change that we had at the end of the year and getting ready for all of that, we've launched a bunch of new affiliate tools, the new affiliate dashboard. We've launched the new brand and the new brand guide, which is amazing. Let's, I mean, let's face it. The, the new brand is just awesome. Um, we've launched a, da a leaderboard so that you can kind of – track where you're doing against other people, other other affiliates in the company. Um, we have launched a new setup wizard for campaigns. This was a big undertaking. We, we realized early on that the secret to success here at Mailbox Power will, to keep, will be to make things as easy as possible. And so the setup wizard goes a long way um, in, in helping that come to fruition. Uh, we continue to do integrations. We just completed an integration with HubSpot, which is a big CRM that's out there. And we're really excited about that. But probably the biggest thing that we've done so far this year, and Joe mentioned it, because we've already produced a million shipments this year, which if you think about what that really means, that's a million PDFs. Because everything that leaves the building comes across to us as individual PDFs. There was a time where I had to rename 200 PDFs manually, like clicking, and I wanted to just like kill myself. It was horrible. <laughs> Could you imagine what it takes to process and build a million PDFs? I can. <laughs> In four months. We, we, we can, yeah. No, absolutely. And so what we've done is we've increased our production systems. We went back to the the groundwork and we rewrote a bunch of stuff. We've automated, automated a whole bunch of stuff and we've really taken a 10x mindset to everything that we've done. So the systems that we've put in place can actually handle not just a million PDFs a quarter, but can actually handle 10 million PDFs a quarter. So we've got a lot of capacity now, a lot of ability to process and handle files and get your orders out that next business day, which is always, always gonna be our, our goal. Uh, in addition to that, we've, we've made some minor bug fixes and enhanced some speed things. We've improved the address book loading. Um, and we integrated, we just finished integrating in the, the drag and drop editor, uh, the ability to link up with your Google Photos. So just making it even, like I said, even easier. And over the next couple of months, that's where our focus is going to be. We've got really amazing projects scheduled and enhancements to the address book, to the shopping cart experience. I know that the 150 limit in the shopping cart is frustrating and where we where we require you to use a campaign if you want to send more to the uh, 150 people that is like top on our list that we are we are working on improving that making it so that there's still a speed component that you don't have to spend a lot of time on our site right we want you in we want you out we want you on with your life making money by using mailbox power so super excited about the future Good, because and it's too. only been four months. I mean, <laughs> <laughs> and and everybody, listen. That has n I, this has nothing to do with everything he does day to day. 
him and Jerry day to day. Day to day is one thing. And then there's the extra, right? I mean, it's, it's amazing to have partners like these two and Jerry's not here. Um, he's probably coding right now because that's what he loves. He does not love the camera. I don't know if you'll ever see him on camera, uh, but I love him too. And I keep sending him Coca-Cola just to make sure he keeps going. So <laughs> that's his deal. Um, but anyway, I guess it's about time for us to start showing this stuff off. I think, I don't know. I'm going to Let's do it. Yeah, well, hold on. No, not yet. I mean, we're close, but I, <laughs> <laughs> anyway, listen, everybody, what you're getting ready to see is a new product line, a new line of products, a new way to personalize products. It literally is a game changer. You're going to see some of our existing products that we're able to now uh, personalize in a new way. And you are going to see some phenomenal new products that are personalized in a new way, but they just, it changes the landscape of the gifting program that we have in place right now. And because everything's personalized, it just ups the game. I mean, I take, I sit here and think constantly because people go, well, what about your competitor over here or over there? And I'm like, what competitor does what we do? They don't, they do parts and pieces of it, but no one does what we do in its entirety. Uh, really the, the ability to, uh, a greeting card, sure. Um, yeah, there's a lot of companies that do that. Uh, there's a lot of companies that personalize products. If you'll buy a gross uh, or 50 or 10, or you wanna wait two weeks or, or a month, sure, lots of companies will do that. But how about companies that actually, you know, print, produce, ship, and give you a tracking number the next business day. How many of those are out there? Yeah, crickets, right? I don't, I don't know. I'm, I'm not hearing about them at all. But anyway, I am super excited to introduce this to you. We have a short video uh, that we're going to go ahead and play. Uh, and uh, we are excited uh, for you to watch this short video. And then we're going to get right into it and show you each product and talk about each product. And it's going to be a good time. So, Vanessa, um, here we go. Ladies and gentlemen, I hope you are excited for Laser Engraved Products, a new line of products from us right here at Mailbox Power that you have access to starting today at the end of this call. Justin's going to walk from this meeting to his office and push a button and it will go live and you will have the ability to order today. But with that being said, Vanessa, can we start sharing exactly what's going on here? <laughs> oh my goodness, Joe. I am like stunned even watching that video with that cool technology. And the, and the, the cool thing is like we're seeing the end result of this. I know you guys have been wa working behind the scenes for ages to dial this in and, and get it to the stage that it is. And I just want to say hats off to you. Hats off for uh, your diligence and always moving this company forward and bringing something that I truly believe is a complete game changer for this company. I couldn't agree more. I couldn't agree more. And by the way, everybody, I just want, I got to share with everybody. We've laser engraved everything. If it doesn't move around here, it's going in the laser engraver. We want to see what it'll do. <laughs> and even true. some that do. And even <laughs> some that do. <laughs> and, and we're all laughing, but it's the truth. I mean, glass. I mean, steel. Aluminum. Frank, Frank's working on a new pattern for golf balls, but it doesn't seem to be working out that way. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, so I really want to start sharing these products. So um, let's see. Um, Casey, do you have one of these, the foldable phone holder in hand, in hand maybe? Yeah. I do. I do. And you know, Joe, while I was watching that video, 
Um, a sports metaphor came to mind, oh if my. you will. Now I'm scared. And you should be. <laughs> what? Um, here's the thing. I live about a quarter mile from a park. And every time I walk by that park, there's little tykes, um, both guys and girls, playing t-ball. And they're, they're little guys. They're like this tall. Like they're four years old playing, playing baseball. And I live in Los Angeles where we've got Dodger Stadium, right? And the Dodgers are, a, as I understand it, a professional baseball playing team. Um, <laughs> uh, this is just as I understand it. Um, here's the difference. I think before today, we were a little bit better than those little guys playing baseball down at the park. What you guys gave us today is the key to Dodger Stadium. You've graduated us as a company customer engagement platform from the little leagues to the major leagues. I hope I got that right. And uh, I just, I'm super stoked. So that's my sports analogy this morning. Um, but let me start with our foldable phone holder. Um, as you guys know, this is in our gift store already, but now we have the ability to literally personalize it with engraving right there on the bottom. Absolutely, oh, I could actually do a fun little mask thing here. Anyways, uh, this is fantastic and it really personalized something that we didn't have the ability to personalize before. Fantastic, popular gift, I'm stoked. Love, love it, love it, love it. Vanessa, what's up next? What's up next, Joe? These I are love cool. it. I love it. Uh, do you have one? Or do you have one of these to share, Vanessa? I believe I do. You guys were kind enough to do one for my husband, Brad, and uh, look how cool that looks. By the way, the font is so classy and so cool and just that was one of the first things i mean i'm a font person i'm a design person i like that kind of thing but that's the first thing brad commented on he's like oh cool font so uh, i'm trying to get this in so you can see it there you go it's very very cool again taking a product that we have and being able to engrave it and personalize it uh just to make someone feel extra special I think it's one of these things, Vanessa, if I can just tag on to this, one of the things that our customers have been really thirsty for is something that can even enhance a brownie or enhance one of our edible products because those packages, even though they're super cool and rad, they get thrown away because they land on somebody's hips, right? So this gives us the ability to um, stay off the hips and uh, on the desk. I don't know. That might you know, be a domain name in there somewhere. But uh, you know, yeah, these wallets, uh, these wallets, you guys, are super, super classy. And I think that's what Vanessa was really speaking to in the font is the class of this um, is awesome. And this is just, and by the way, I don't know this to be true, but I, well, I kind of do. This is just the beginning. This is like inning one. I think that's the right term for baseball. I could totally be off on this. Yeah. But, uh, so, yeah, you let's go. Two two today, man. Yeah, two for two. <laughs> I'm on a roll. <laughs> I love it. And by the way, everybody, um, we're starting at the bottom and working our way up. When you see what's coming at the end oh. of this game, <laughs> it's, it's game on. Okay. So. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Hold on. There's one other thing, too, that I wanted to share. By the way, there are four of these wallets. Uh, the one that you're seeing on the right actually is the black leather. There's a brown leather version of that. And the one on the left, uh, really, you could keep in your purse or in your pocket uh, or anywhere you want. But there's also another version that Ken's holding. Ken, would you just share? Hold on one second. Let oh. me uh, get you here. So go ahead and show show them that really quick. Well, Put that thing, thing up that, there. One thing that we need to point out. How do you do this? I'm not well, it's tricky. It's that. tricky. It's um, was that Rusty Hamrick's name? Rusty Hamrick, there he is. Look at yep, that. <laughs> okay. I guess we're gonna have to send that to him now. <laughs> okay. Well, so one thing we got to keep in mind is these wallets are RFID wallets, so they protect your data from getting stolen because people can come up to your wallet or your purse and scan a scanner from the outside and get all your information. So these wallets are um, have a really good use besides they're pretty good looking so yep. and, and of course we have this as well and I, i'm here um, <laughs> uh, the business card uh, holder briefcase now laser engraved instead of just uv printed 
Uh, this will not come off. And any of you that have had one of these, um, you may have noticed that, uh, you know, the ink after time, when it gets beat around a little bit, it can, uh, it can have a problem. But anyway, um, like I said, if it didn't move, we were laser engraving it over the last month. So that's pretty much and what's Joe, been going on. One thing to really keep in mind for all of our customers here is the creativity around these products is off the chart. Like just off the top of my head, you could do something where it's like, hey, we help you protect your customers by protecting your what's in your wallet, right? Mm -hmm. You know, there's a lot of fun, creative things that our designers and the people inside as customers that are going to give us great ideas is just, I, I am so excited to see the creativity that we all come up with on these things. <laughs> me too, me too. Well, um, Vanessa, what's next? I'll tell you what, Joe, uh, these things are cool. These are very cool. And um, in my opinion, a little bit in the masculine vein of things, but here's where you guys spoke to me in a huge way. Oh, yes. <laughs> yeah. the, the personalized tumbler. The personalized tumbler. First of all, I will tell you, I love tumblers like this for so many reasons. It's an insulated tumbler. So this is how cool it looks with your name engraved on there insulated tumbler. You can put cold drinks in this. You can put warm drinks in this. You can do anything. It's going to keep your cold drinks cold, your warm drinks warm. I've used it for camping. I've used it out by the pool. I've used it all over the place, but these tumblers are amazing. And what a cool, classy way to put someone's name on something that they'll actually use on a daily basis. So, so what you've been putting in that tumbler, Vanessa? I, I'm telling you. I mean, I did have a little bit of coffee. Okay. <laughs> it's an adult sippy cup. Let's face it. It's an, oh, that's the other part of it. It's it's got this lid on the top, so it's perfect for outdoors. And you know, you can put like like I was saying, the cold beverage with the ice. You don't get the ice in your face every time you try to drink it. It's very cool. Very cool. Well, and I'll just say just as one of the um, one of the benefits of these little guys is last night I had ice in mine and this morning I, I had left it on the counter all last night and this morning I went to empty it for this <laughs> for this video and the ice, even though it was overnight, was 100% intact. Like the ice hadn't even melted really at all. So from an insulation um, perspective, absolutely awesome. I love it. I the love other it. thing I love about this, if I can just say this, Joe, I love the fact that it's got this black matte powder coating on it. It's yeah. such, it, it's so cool. It's just very, very cool. And this is something I'm proud to have on the counter. It's not obnoxious in any way whatsoever. And a lot of things out there are. <laughs> so this is very cool. Agreed. And I'll tell you what, um, nobody's even seen the prices yet. When you see the prices, you may fall out of your chair. So please, folks, listen, um, when you review the pricing, please be sitting down. Don't. OK, everything will be fine. Arms on your chair because um, the prices are phenomenal. OK. Oh, yeah. You know what? Hey, uh, Vanessa, we're going to share uh, the Takea uh, right now. Uh, real quick. I'm going to have uh, Ken uh, show that. One sec here. Perfect. To get us to a solo layer because this one we didn't have pictures of. Uh, <laughs> we've been working hard. Remember these big old water bottles? Yeah. How do you do it? Yeah, you got it. Okay, you so got it. Yeah. This is the 40 ounce Takea and it's engraved with one of our employees, Chella. Anyway, it's beautiful, but something we're going to be able to do with these our existing water bottles is engraved on them. Now, I'm gonna tell you a secret. I'm gonna let the cat out of the bag. Go check out the pricing of the Takeas later today and see what we've done there. Okay, all right, here we go. Back to it. <laughs> okay, Vanessa, right, what, so what's next on the hit parade? Next might be, well, I honestly couldn't even pick a favorite item. I was sitting here going, no, I love this. No, I love this. No, I love this. Here's something I really, really love. Really love. What the next slide is. Okay, uh -huh. awesome. Yes, yes. Oh my goodness, us and the journal thing. It is one of the banes of our existence trying to keep yeah. enough journals in stock in this joint is impossible. And here we have a new journal, laser engraved new journal. Uh, so I'm assuming both of you have have one of these. Casey, you're going to show this thing off. Oh, they both uh, got yeah. them. Okay. Oh, yeah. I'm ready to. Oh, here they are. 
<laughs> here, the, the cool thing about a journal is it becomes a it becomes truly a personal journey. So our customers customers now have the ability to start a customer or start somebody that they care about or start somebody that's been a good customer, for example, on their own journey. I mean, the, the, the amount of classy journals, I think that we'll be sending out to customers and customers, customers is absolutely off the chart. I know um, traveling around when, we, when we're out at live events and we're at uh, webinars and seminars, it's great to keep all our notes or our personal thoughts uh, right inside one of these is just absolutely classy. Absolutely classy. I love it, guys. Yes. Now, um, I noticed neither one of you spoke to the pin holder that's a part of that journal as well. <laughs> Hold on, Vanessa. I'm going to take you uh, into a solo layout. Here you go. Yeah. So, yeah, it does have a pen holder as part of this journal. I love this for a couple of reasons. First of all, the size is perfect. Um, it's got lined lined paper inside. I don't know if you can see that lined paper inside. And it also has this handy little uh, place mark so you can um, keep track of where you are in your journal entries. I use journals every single day, Joe, and I really, really, really love this one. And thanks for putting my name on it. Oh. <laughs> and just just to reiterate, I think what, I think what we're all going to see as these roll out into the marketplace, guys, is these are really classy. These are not, I, I mean, I, I, I'm not saying anything about our brownie and our edible line, but these are not, um, these are not the caliber of brownies, right? I mean, this is a true leather, like not chintzy, not inexpensive um, feeling and look. And when we understand the power of personalization combined with the class and the quality of what we're bringing to the marketplace i it like we might even be an all-star team i don't know that might have been pushing it you're pushing it case you're pushing it listen uh, joe we have a question from someone that uh bonnie says is the cover suede like yes it is bonnie yeah. it is beautiful if you're a texture person like i am i don't know if you guys can see but it is and it is absolutely gorgeous. And like Casey said, a very high-end gift, a very beautiful gift that I can't imagine anybody not wanting to use this. Well, I'll, I'll tell you, you know, my, my, parents, um, my parents have journals at their house. So anybody that walks through the front door at, one of, at my parents' house has to sign a guest book. This is going to be the new guest book. And I promise you the class, I just... We, we're classing up the operation. That's really what it comes down to. <laughs> yeah. yeah. So, Casey, if I heard you right, if you send brownies in this journal, the brownies are going to kind of get overlooked for a minute, uh, and then the journal's coming straight to face. Well, what's going to really happen is the, the brownies will end up on somebody's hip, and then they're going to have to write their health journey in the journal. <laughs> <laughs> so we'll add it, and then we'll help them remove it. Right. Perfect. Perfect. And we're still helping the dentist, right? Create cavities with brownies. So everything's good. I'm telling you guys, stop knocking those brownies. They are no. amazing. No, the way, the way I honestly look at this is these are enhancements. Yeah. And where, where for me, what I've always thought was that for me, brownies have been our top of the line. It's been the best thing for me getting my own phone to ring, helping our customers phone to ring this secures it this product line literally just cements and secures that so i will probably end up sending out more brownies because now i can enhance those brownies with something that's timeless and classy at the same time love it i absolutely love it okay vanessa Joe, can I just say one thing, guys, please realize as you're watching this, and I know that a lot of you are out there making comments, sometimes we don't actually see the comments in real time. We're trying to get to as many questions as we possibly can, but if we moved on from the item, that's why we're not addressing those because the comments aren't coming in in a timely fashion. So we're not ignoring you, promise. <laughs> <laughs> and we'll answer those questions today, or Justin will anyway. Somebody will answer them. <laughs> yeah. Not? So <laughs> there right. were some questions about how many lines of text and things like that. Again, this is the entry into this whole arena. There's one line of text right now. Um, who knows what will happen in the future? Because I know these guys over here. 
I know these guys he, and they're never, ever here. satisfied with status quo, right? They're always improving things. So right now that's what we have and uh, look to the future. Yeah, we launched everything with two fonts. Right now we've shown you the one that we all like. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Not that the other font's not bad, but it's a little more standard. It's just an italic font, and it's it looks really good as well. Um, but it's not as scripty. It's definitely easier to read. But it's all based around preset themes. So we don't give you any chance to mess anything up with these. <laughs> but at the same time, we're going to be adding additional themes and options and all sorts of really cool stuff as we get down the road a little bit. Yep. Right. So I see comments out there. Can I add a logo? Not yet. Not yet is the answer. The answer is never no. It's not yet. <laughs> That's, right. That's exactly right. Okay, Vanessa, it's time to move along. We're going to answer all those questions before we're done today. Too. Okay, let me tell you. Um, the next item that's up, when we opened this, my husband and I opened this together, and he's like, oh, this is perfect for you. Because I am known among our little circle of friends as the charcuterie queen. <laughs> <laughs> oh, how is it to be known as the charcuterie queen? And if, if you've ever spent time with Vanessa, she loves to cook and loves stuff comes out of the kitchen and you ain't putting it down. This fork in face. Let's go. So <laughs> <laughs> now for those of you that know me, I have food issues and I love visiting Vanessa. So anyway. <laughs> food issues. <laughs> So oh, let God. me just grab this board, Joe, because it's a little bit big. So, oh, please L listen, folks. This thing is weighty. As a matter of fact, I sent this to Vanessa and she goes, Is that it? And I said, Well, lift the box, Vanessa. And she goes, Oh, my goodness, there's definitely something left in there for sure. Uh, yeah. <laughs> yep. Okay. Vanessa, yes. show that thing off. And so, here's the, the beautiful bamboo charcuterie board with the tool set right there. So no more running around looking for your cheese knives and things like that, which I have been known to do. Um, it's right here in the board. It, this is fantastic. I, I'm, as a matter of fact, we're going to a dinner party tonight and I am taking this and I will have a full spread of meats and cheeses right here on this board. And it and it's marked with your name on it. Nobody's keeping it. Nobody's keeping it. They might want to, they might think it's their board. <laughs> <laughs> and that's, but I'm not really no this one. that's no sticker that's not a label that's actually engraved right into the bamboo so and so let me yeah let's talk about that a second joe i don't know if people can see that but it is actually engraved in i can feel it there's a texture to it it's not something just printed on the top of this board it's actually like laser engraved into this. And I will say this also with the different densities, specifically on bamboo, sometimes you get a little variation in the print and it looks so cool. It's such a cool look. Yes, definitely. Uh, one of the things I love about bamboo as well is, you know, uh, it's good for the environment. Uh, that stuff grows at like a foot a day. And <laughs> I'm going to tell you, they love hacking it down and using it for this kind of stuff. And, and this isn't the last bamboo product you're going to see today. So, um, you know, as you're seeing things, we're kind of, uh, we started kind of small and we're kind of growing up to a few things that are coming here. But uh, anyway, uh, this, you know, laser and great product. Uh, Casey, who do you see using this? Uh, I see so many people from from realtors using that as a as a welcoming gift, even to for insurance agents using it as welcome gifts when somebody does maybe say a new homeowner's policy. Um, I can see this being used by all types of folks that have maybe Airbnb properties. Maybe they list their name of their house or their Airbnb property. A lot of folks name their name their houses um, on the Airbnb sequence. So. Being able to bring those into the marketplace, um, it's just the world is open um, now for anybody that plays in the kitchen, even as an amateur, this will class them up. Like I can barely like cut bologna in four slices and slap it on a board. And this is going to allow me to go from a paper plate to make me look classy. It's fantastic. Well, I'm thankful you got David there because if you can't cut bologna, my goodness, you might you might be just you might be starved or, or uh, relinquished to potato chips and ranch dressing. Exactly. So, so Casey, if I get this straight, um, you're comparing that to like a grand slam. Right? <laughs> 
I, I, is that what is that an end zone thing? <laughs> oh, he's gone off. He's uh, done. Go pick some more touchdowns. All right. Yeah. <laughs> Casey, you're batting a thousand. Oh, hey, boy. copy that. So, Joe, I can see someone sending this along with a card that tells someone how to build the perfect charcuterie board or something about different meats and cheeses and from different regions and where to get them and that kind of thing. I mean, can you imagine sending this either with a regular five by seven card or with a gigagram to show people exactly how to build it? I love Maybe it. there's a group of delis out there or high-end restaurants that they do or high-end caterers and high-end party planners that when somebody books a party or, a, or yeah. a, a catered meal with, this could make an excellent thank you gift for those folks as well. And, and by the way, you don't just have to have a name on there. You could say thank you. You could say congratulations, Merry Christmas, Happy Hanukkah. You could do all kinds of things, engraving on this, um, even even a short saying. So uh, it it there really the sky's the limit. Just think about this in terms of what you could do and who would find this gift to be so lovely. It's such a really nice, beautiful, and again, heavy gift. Yeah. And we still haven't gotten to my favorites yet. <laughs> okay. I, I, I love everything I'm seeing, but we're still not there to my favorite. I'm anxious. Could you guys tell? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. All right. Well, anyway, ah, charcuterie. I love it. I love eating it. I love this board. It's classy. It's an awesome gift. But um, here we are, folks. Now we're really, we're really stepping some things up here with this gift. Uh, this is a. A uh, card, uh, two decks of cards, four different colors of poker chips, dice. And by the way, did you know that Ken's responsible for sourcing these things? And he looks at me and he goes, Joe, those are not plastic cheap poker <laughs> chips. They're made of clay. And I went, oh, well, all right then. <laughs> but uh, but yeah. nothing's got to be made clear here. Um, Justin actually found this piece. So oh, I can't take credit for it. Well. <laughs> <laughs> all right. Here we are. Go big or go home. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> well, I'm looking what forward to somebody sharing this. What so, a wonderful family gift, right? What a wonderful gift to send to a family. Casey. Yeah. So what's cool is, you know, this is, this is again, this is leather. This is not like cardboard, um, not paper mache. This is actually hard bound leather. And so um, what's really cool about it is, like, uh, like Ken said, these are clay chips. These are not your plastic dollar store chips. And what makes this really cool, you know, my brother is in several poker clubs. And I've always struggled with what to send him as a gift because the guy has everything. This is a fun, unique, really class. Again, I know I keep using the word classy, but being able to send him one of these with his name on it, now he gets to feel like a rock star when he goes toddling into his uh, next poker game. Uh, as well as, um, you know, folks, again, that have Airbnb properties, for example. Uh, what a great thing to have the name of the property on a poker club, uh, on a poker set. So when your guests come and visit, now they have something to play and be entertained by. So the, the, again, the ideas are endless. And that's what's so fantastic about our brain trust we have here at Mailbox Power is this creativity is going to come out all over the place over the next few weeks. And you can see Michael and Brenda Sanchez, you know, I mean, that's kind of, this is their thing. And, and of course, um, they have one in hand already. And you know what surprised me was the weight of this thing. I mean, this thing is, it's heavy. It sure is. It's, it's really got some weight to it, um, but it's just so classy. Um, uh, let's see. And I, I got to say that it's where... The leather, the black leather, when it's removed by the laser, it's revealing a silver metallic finish behind it. So whatever's engraved is actually revealed uh, with that metallic finish. And it is so phenomenal and so classy uh, that I've, I'm just saying, if you send this, you will not be embarrassed in any way, shape or form at all. Like this thing really, really rocks. Well, and Joe, just to your point, and I think that's one of the things that really makes this entire product line um, step the game up several different levels is these gifts would have all been really amazing just being able to UV print on them. They would That would have been a huge step forward. But what the engraving actually does 
is it adds a perceived level of caring that you can't get by just printing something on something. If that makes sense. At least that's just my 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 two cents from a marketer standpoint that personalized and engraved personalized with a card in the way that these boxes are packaged. I um I received a big care package uh um with all these in here and my whole goal I said to Joe I said to Joe last night I'm like I haven't opened anything. I've kept it on there. And then I had to call Joe back like 10 minutes later and go, yeah, don't put me on camera asking me to unbox it because everything's already unboxed. Like I just, like I was like, a kid, it was like a kid the night before Christmas. I couldn't do it. So I have, I kind of have some of the boxes laying around, but even the way that these are packaged and the packaging within the packaging is classy. It's not like that shows up and it's just wrapped in a bag. Like it's in a really nice box with really nice um, shredded stuff around it. Like we can be confident that the impact these are going to have when we dominate the mailbox is is off the charts. I love it. I love this is one of my favorite gifts. It really is. I, we still haven't gotten to my favorite gift yet, but this is one of my favorites for sure. Okay. Well, are we ready for the next one? And yeah, Joe, we have a comment um, from someone saying, I can't wait to get back some of my clients who are asking for some higher end gifts. This is the perfect opportunity. They'll love it. So very, very excited to uh, to share this with everybody. And hopefully all of you watching are excited to share it with your clients because we have had a lot of requests for higher end gifts. And that's exactly what prompted this. Yes, yes, we are delivering on that for sure. And it will continue because the opportunities are, wow. Okay, mind boggling, no doubt about it. Okay, is everybody ready for this next one? It, I think this might be your favorite, right, Joe? It is not, but it is really <laughs> high up on the list. <laughs> I, it's not my favorite, but boy, it is. I love barbecue. I love my Traeger. Uh, and we even have a Traeger here at the office, but a barbecue set, bamboo. Mm -hmm. This thing has significance to it. It is like two feet at least in, in uh, width. Uh, it's weighty. It's got a great handle to it. I mean, uh, it is just an amazing piece. As a matter of fact, let me get this thing up here. Uh, here we go. So yes, uh, absolutely phenomenal, Casey. Show them the front of the case where the yeah. name uh, in, so, in great uh, front. So again, this is what's so cool is um, the engraving on this, going back to what Vanessa said, just from a marketer's perspective, the variance in this proves that it's even a step above, yeah. right? And so I love that this is engraved. There is some variance in it. It's every, every product is actually becoming completely unique. Um, and again, you know, I'm just thinking off the top of my head, my brother, my brother loves his Traeger, can never figure out what to guy, buy the guy. Bam. New dads for Mother's new, new dads for Mother's Day. That's perfect. <laughs> um, uh, but, but it's a great, great barbecue set for the man or the woman that cooks outside, maybe for cooking schools to be able to send as a thank you gift to high-end clients that come through their cooking school. There's all, again, I, I don't know why I'm fixated on this Airbnb thing, but you know, all these Airbnb owners being able to put their their resort name on the, right on there, put some tumblers with that, put a poker set with that, and be able to brand an entire property with several of our gifts with the brand name of the property on there. Oh, my gosh. Time out. Sorry. Um, the barbecue won't work for this. But every boat owner names their boat. Mm. Think about what we can do for boat owners now when we send them a boat, uh, a, a bar, uh, some tumblers, the poker chips, the next thing we're going to show you, um, a bunch of that stuff with their boat name on it. Yeah. Oh, my gosh. Somebody's buying a $10 million boat. The boat salesperson could be sending that as a whole thank you gift set. Now we can play with the big boys. I love it. I love it. Okay. Are we moving on to my favorite gift yet? I think so. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> all right uh, and by the way hold on i gotta stop here one second um i sent one of these to vanessa and vanessa's name was not on it yeah. <laughs> it was her husband's name exactly <laughs> and look how big this thing is guys like it can hardly get in the picture this thing is huge 
do you know how happy he was? Joe? Well, you saw we live, we opened it live with you and he was absolutely thrilled with this. It's the coolest thing. And again, one of those things, I love what you're saying about the boats, uh, Casey, uh, RVs, new homes. I mean, you could do so, so much with this. So I mean, people that rent out their RVs. Yeah. Right? I mean, there are all kinds of things where, where, where if we think about how people make an investment, a big purchase, and then they want to brand that purchase, this could be another really unique opportunity to do that outside of just putting somebody's name on there. I mean, that's super, super powerful, but just another idea. Yeah. No doubt. And I guess I probably should have put David's name on that because Casey, I'm not sure you ever touched a tool in a barbecue in your life. Nope. <laughs> Okay. Right All right. Well, first mistake we made. There you go. All right. <laughs> All right. Well, um, I think it's time. Um, my favorite gift. Here it is. Um, not the most expensive gift, but I love this gift for so many reasons. And here it is. Yes. Um, it's a box to hold wine with all of the tools uh, for opening that bottle of wine and drinking it with the exception of, of course, the two tumblers that should be inside of this box. And I'm hoping uh, that uh, Vanessa or uh, Vanessa, do you have this box with the with them in it as well? I have oh, the box oh, Casey. and I've got the I two do. tumblers right here like this. Awesome. Okay. Hold on. Hold on. I got to get you to a layout here. Perfect. Okay. Yes. So yes. the two tumblers, the box with the name on the front, it's so, so classy. And again, I have to commend you guys. You did a great job making sure that the size was appropriate for the size of the gift. Yeah. So everything in here looks so good. It looks so good and it's so impressive. And even though I knew what was coming, you know, we've talked about these gifts. I've seen some of them. Even though I knew what was coming in the box that you sent, Joe, as we opened it, I was so impressed when I started to feel these things, to touch them. The quality is just top notch. And I'm all about things that look good and feel good and actually are high quality. And that is definitely what this is. Yeah. These are going, these are, um, I think there's going to, I'm going to, I'm going to coin a term here. I don't, I, and that is these gifts that we're showing off today, guys, I really feel are display worthy. And I think that's really what keeps coming up for me is each of these things, whether it's the poker set, whether it's the charcuterie board, whether it's the wine box, they're all display worthy. People are not going to be embarrassed to have these displayed on their bar, for example, or in, uh, in, uh, in their glass cabinet with the, with the tumblers or, I think that's really a powerful distinction when we can put something in the hands of our customers that's display worthy. Absolutely. You know, I keep thinking about this. I love this wine box. It's my favorite gift because on occasion I end up going to someone's house and I take a bottle of wine and to show up with a bottle of wine in that box, right? <laughs> it's so classy. It's just all ready to go. If they're missing a tool, Got you covered. We're right here. Let's go. Uh, I do, and I love the, again, it's that black leather material. And when the laser removes that black leather material, it leaves that uh, silver or gold material behind it. Uh, it's got a metallic, you know, kind of a shine and feel to it. It is, it just reeks of class. It really does. It's just a great, great gift. And the price point, I, I'm not even there yet. I mean, when you see the price point, you're probably just going to order one. Well, Joe, let me throw, let me just kind of throw one of these ideas um, that I think could be really powerful. You know, as um, people that throw events like um, speaker events, and this is just the space I live in. So I'm just, this is a, sort of off the top of my head. All promoters and event planners usually have different tiers. And many, many of us have been to, to workshops and seminars where they've got the general population, and then there's usually a VIP area, and then there's usually like the VVIP area, and then there's the other speakers at the events. Well, my gosh, can you imagine as a speaker or as an attendee, if you walked into an event and your name was on something like this, sat in a, in a chair where you were one of the VIPs, the power of that as a speaker or as an event promoter or planner, I mean, 
it, it's it this it will be talked about and more importantly it will be shown on social media rather than just putting your logo on something um, that sits on everybody's desk. The power of the personalization with this in terms of making somebody feel special and important is off the chart with these. It's just the, the game is we're in a different ball game. <laughs> I, I, was, I was gonna try to go for something, but yeah. <laughs> I couldn't decide whether it was the Super Bowl or the Kentucky <laughs> Derby. But whatever is like the top game, that's what we're playing. You got it. Casey, we're in the major leagues now is what the oh, real deal is. Exactly. Okay, major leagues. <laughs> That's it. That's it. We're in the big leagues now. And these gifts, I mean, just think about this. I was just sitting here thinking we've got Mother's Day, Father's Day, Memorial Day, um, Memorial Day picnics. Can you imagine taking the barbecue set to a Memorial Day picnic? Fourth of July pool parties. I mean, there are so many opportunities just in the next month or so to uh, to use these gifts, to explore these gifts, and to gift these to other people. Yes, awesome. So listen, we have about eight minutes left to kill this thing in an hour, to be done in one hour, right? And I don't know if we can do it, but we got a couple of things to cover. I saw quite a few questions coming up. Um, we have a little incentive we want to talk about as well, uh, which is pretty kick butt. Uh, ready to, uh, we want to talk about that as well. Um, but I think um, let's answer a few of the questions that came up. Uh, let's see. Uh, I, I think uh, how when can they order? Let's start there. As soon as I... So it's a blank. Go right across the hall over there and push the button. Okay, cool. <laughs> so that's going to happen soon. Question. Bye. <laughs> <laughs> you're you're that's excused. My computer right there. Yeah. So, uh, <laughs> <laughs> you're saying Justin okay. could go to his office. Got it. Okay. He can be excused for just a moment. Okay. So uh, I guess the next question: Can I include these in a campaign? Yes. Okay. The answer Absolutely. is yes. He got. We got the nod. Uh, <laughs> can we use merge fields? Yes, of course. Oh, and yes, we can use Bert. Wow. Okay, so you're saying I can actually go add a foldable phone holder with first name in a merch field and add it to a campaign. And I'm oh, okay. All right. I didn't know this. Uh, so <laughs> here we go. Yeah, absolutely. I mean, the the system locks down the edit, the drag and drop editor. You make these the exact same way you make any of their other products. That you, you'll just notice that when you get into it. It doesn't give you the ability to upload photos or really change anything. All you can do is enter the text that you want and you can pick your font um, right before you get into the editing screen. And over time, we'll be adding more and more themes. And the reason that we have to lock everything down is because lasers like images that are vector. And for those of you who don't know what a vector image is, just it's an image that can be blown up to any side. It's based off of a mathematical formula rather than pixels. So we can't let you just upload a picture because it won't laser very well. Um, that being said, we are working on some technologies that will allow you to do those types of things. And we're working on some catalog options where you can, if you do want to put a, lo a logo on some of these and you want to order, let's say 50 or 100 of them, we can definitely help accommodate you uh, through the chat. So uh, those, all of that type of stuff is coming with additional layouts. Frank actually did some really amazing glasses the other day and he had a really well done design. It's a design that I, I like so much. We're going to work on getting it added as a, as a template option pretty darn quick. So couldn't be more excited about where we can take this, but we were like, Hey, look, let's, let's just get this thing ready to rock and roll. Let's test it out. Let's see how it goes. We've got about a dozen products that I think we've shown here today. And we've probably got ideas already for like a couple dozen more. So uh, there, uh, yep, there you go. And we do the beginning. A couple of ideas. Um, did you remember that picture that was out of focus? As many of you saw, um, the whole table here was filled. It was kind of crazy. Uh, anyway, let's talk about uh, another question I'm seeing. Can we pick the? Can they pick the size of the letters? No. So everything is predetermined for you. You literally only just type your message in. Uh, most of the products you can fit up to 25 characters uh, in. So that as long as it's within 25 characters, it'll work. Like I said, if you have something unique or special outside of that, uh, we can accommodate some things through the chat. There may be some minimum order quantities required to do that, but 
uh, 25 characters as we played around with it is, is long enough for a decent phrase and it should accommodate most names. So, okay. Yeah. And there, um, somebody asked about the font for initials. Yes. You can just type in initials. And of course, you know, I see it says the switch, Justin, the switch. They're saying, get out of here and go pull the switch. <laughs> <laughs> The moment I pull the switch, everyone stops paying attention to this. Right, exactly. <laughs> so um, anyway, did, um, uh, Vanessa, did you see any other questions that needed to be answered? Uh, no, actually, Joe, I think you've done a fantastic job addressing some of the questions that have come in. And uh, people are, it looks like they're super excited. And yes, they're all like, Justin, go, go, go. <laughs> I'm going to order my wine box today at the poker set today because I don't even have one yet. Yeah. So anyway, how does pricing work? Uh, pricing. Uh, yeah, pricing. We uh, the pricing will be online. Uh, the pricing's phenomenal, folks. Like really, um, sit your butts down when you're <laughs> when you're looking at the pricing. You're going to be shocked. Uh, nothing exceeds a hundred dollars. Uh, so I mean, this is all phenomenal quality products at a great price. As always, for our pro members, um, you guys got it. Uh, if you're a pro member, you're going to get the best price possible uh, with these laser engraved uh, you, you products. Still, we we manage to price these in a ways where you. As a pro member with us, you still get a 25% discount over everyone else on these products. So everything works the same as all of our other products. So on some of these items, the barbecue sets, the wine boxes, the cheese board, that's a significant savings. Like you could pay for your membership just by sending a couple of those. Yeah, so exactly. just yep. in the savings. And, and I think guys, one of the things that we have had a lot of opportunities that some of our customers have been really thirsty for is that it's not always about the price of the product. It's really about the impact that that product has as it lands in somebody's mailbox. So I'm going to, I'm going to say for, for me personally, more important than the pricing of it. And even though I know you guys work really hard to keep the pricing in line, the impact that these will have when they land in customers' mailboxes, I, I, you could have doubled the pricing. Like, I, I literally don't get how you guys- Hang on, Casey, you gotta go <laughs> program some stuff. <laughs> I just think it is, I just think it is um, really important for us to go to our customers that are um, really trying to create impact. And I think when, when we now can deliver a true impactful product to their customers, it's, it's, a, it is a, it's so, such a game changer. And I'll just throw this out there that a lot of businesses have a lot of budget where they're not focused on price. We just, it's an extra benefit that they'll actually create bigger impact because our pricing is so beyond amazing. I just think, don't anybody lose sight of the fact that the impact that these will have, the social media play that companies will get by sending these out to their customers is something they won't be able to buy, certainly not for the price point that they're going to get with us here at Mailbox Power. That's well said. Very true. Very true. Okay, folks, let's take a look at this incentive and then let's get some parting words and let's get Justin into his office to his computer and click the button so we can all go make some orders. So um, here we go. Um, this is it. We do have an incentive we have created. You could win one of every single product that we have in the laser category, including the ones that are not listed, which is that uh 40 ounce to K, a water bottle and the wallets themselves. So listen, here's how it works. You get two entries into the drawing per order of the wine box, the barbecue tool set, the family poker set, and the cheese, the cheese board charcuterie set. You get one entry per order of the stainless wine glasses, the 40 ounce to the suede journal, the phone holder, the business card holder, or any of the wallets will get you one entry as well. So each purchase between 12.01 a.m. last night or this morning and Wednesday at 11.59 p.m. Pacific earns an entry or two into the drawing to win one of each item. Um, the drawing will take place uh, on my update Friday, May 7th, which is just coming up here uh, this Friday. So uh, I am <laughs> I'm super excited, folks. Uh, listen, uh, parting words. Uh, I'm going to start with Ken. Hey, Joe. I know, I know right? Joe, 
real quick before you go into final final words, just um, uh, one question to clarify on the incentive. Um, this is open to anybody that has a mailbox power account, correct? Absolutely. Yes. Anybody, so have- anybody. Awesome. Awesome. If you make an order, we're in. And, I don't and even if somebody that. comes on board, if somebody comes on board today or tomorrow, they still can participate in this in this incentive program, which is awesome. Yeah. That is absolutely accurate. Okay, uh, Ken, uh, let's start with you, my friend. Uh, any last words? Off the hook. No, not quite. Right. <laughs> <laughs> Anything? Well, you know. A couple, an hour ago, Mailbox Power was a different company. And now we can, we've been elevated. These products are really going to make such a big difference with our family and friends and our customers. It's unbelievable what we're going to be able to do. And, um, and it's only the beginning. So hold on tight, buckle up because these products are coming. And, uh, more and more. Now, there's no limit to what Mailbox Power can do um, in the gifting world. Love it. Love it. Justin. Yep, absolutely. And, you know, I just want to say thank you to all of you. We're here because of you, because of your support. I mean, we've had so many of you start this live with us in the middle of your Saturday. And, you know, we're just so appreciative of, of all your support. That's why we love what we do. And we do what we do is because of you. So, Keep the feedback coming. Thank you again for your support. And and we love you guys. Awesome. I appreciate it. Okay. Casey Eberhardt, sir. I I am, um, you know, I I don't get rendered speechless too often. And (laughs) one of the things about what has occurred this morning is that there is a foundational shift in where we're moving. Doesn't mean that what we've done before is just put by the wayside. This just goes on top of everything that we do here. You know, Joe says in our morning calls all the time that we're a great customer engagement platform. Well, I think we went from a customer engagement platform or even an awesome engagement platform to the customer engagement platform. And I think that going from a to the even though it may seem really small at its foundation, at its core is massive. And so to you guys, um, uh, the guys and gals that are responsible for putting all this together, just from folks of us that are in the field that are, are talking to customers and showing customers how they can kind of put a fence around their customers and really um, create revenue and create win back campaigns and create referrals and celebrate birthdays. What you have given us is, a new opportunity starting today. And so I think for all of us that are customers of Mailbox Power, I just want to say thank you because what you've really allowed us to do is help us use the customer engagement platform to go grow our businesses. And for that, I think I speak on behalf of every customer we have and every customer we're about to go talk to. I just want to say thank you guys. Awesome, Casey. I appreciate that. Vanessa, my dear. Okay, I want to say thank you to you three in particular for never being satisfied, for always moving this company forward and for pushing forward. And I know that it's exhausting and I know that you spend endless time because I know I do and I know Casey does too. We're constantly thinking about Mailbox Power, constantly thinking about what can happen and and what we can do and how we can promote and how we can help people. And that's the really the bottom line to all this is you now have an entire new arsenal of tools that you can use to help people build their business. And that's what it's all about, right, folks? It's all about helping other people be successful. So thank you to the three of you, uh, Joe, Justin, and Ken, and Jerry, of course. Thank you, Jerry, as well. 
But thank you guys for never sitting back and being comfortable and for always leaning forward and pushing forward. And to all of you out there watching, I would love for you to go to your Facebook group, to the Mailbox Power Facebook group that you're a part of and comment about these products. Give us your ideas. Give us ideas on how you're going to use this. Remember, it's not just about the personalization on the product. You could put a word, you could put an inspiring little short message or something like that. So please jump into those Facebook groups and let's help each other and inspire each other on how we can use these products and how we can get them out there and help people realize what we have here at Mailbox Power. Thank you, Vanessa. Well said. Uh, well said, Casey. Thank you to my partners. Uh, and again, I'm going to reiterate what Casey said. I am so thankful for each and every one of you that are watching this today. I'm thankful not only for your business, but I'm thankful uh, that you see what we saw uh, in this platform. Uh, you know, this was built by, by uh, before I got here, as far as the platform itself, it was Justin and Jerry. And all of a sudden it's like, oh my gosh, this has been a fun white knuckle ride. You know, that white knuckle ride you've been on that you're just, I mean, all the way, like, this is so fun. Um, that's what we're doing here. Uh, so thank you again to all the customers out there that are looking at us right now. You're seeing this video, uh, maybe seeing us for the first time. I can't tell you how thankful we are to you uh, as the customer base. We're doing everything in our power uh, to give you the tools you need. I got to tell you, we sit around often and we look at what you're doing, the customer. What are you doing with this platform? How can we change the experience that you're having with our platform? How can we reduce the number of clicks that you have to do to get something done? How can we give you the best platform on the planet? We feel we've done that, but there's so much room for improvement <laughs> always. We are, it's sad that we're never satisfied. I gotta tell you, we get to sales numbers and I'm like, before we even get there, I'm like, I know we're gonna hit it, but damn it, we gotta surpass that. And I'm constantly, it's just a, it's a, you know, uh, anyway, um, it's just been a great ride. And I appreciate each and every one of you. I want you to all have a wonderful weekend and please enjoy these gifts. Make your phone ring, impress somebody, create a relationship you didn't have before and get those referrals you, ne you have never gotten uh, by utilizing this new gifting line. This is game on. We'd love your suggestions uh, and we are listening. Thank you. Have a wonderful weekend. We're out. Bye-bye. <laughs>